A controversial synthetic drug known as K2 or Spice is being blamed for the death of an 18-year-old Bloomfield Township man. 7 Action News reporter Tom Wade has been gathering details on this investigation. It's just so sad, Tom. What have you found Ab out? Absolutely, Diana. And I just spoke with an expert a few minutes ago, and he says this may be the first ever K2-related overdose and death that he's ever heard of. This young man, only 18 years old. I couldn't believe it. I didn't think it was true. Ryan Young on getting the news that his lifelong friend, Oliver Satchel Smith, died of an apparent overdose here on this private beach on Wing Lake. Police believe 18-year-old Oliver was smoking the drug widely known as K2, or synthetic pot, and that it killed him. He was getting his act together. His, his life was coming back together, and he just... I, I personally think that to celebrate his success that he was having in life and everything, he just went down here one night to just say, whatever, you know, I've been doing so well. Investigators say Oliver was alone on the private beach when he overdosed. His body was found by a fisherman Saturday morning. Ryan says he's already launched a petition drive to get K2 banned. I don't think anyone else wants their son to die over it, their daughter. I don't want this for anybody. It's really sad. The medical examiner will make the final call on what exactly killed Oliver. They will be conducting toxicology tests. And the young man you saw in the piece there has gathered 300 signatures so far for his petition. Reporting live in Bloomfield Township, I'm Tom Waits, 7 Action News.